post-camp interview with Jay Haygood. Best offensive line coach on this side of the Eastern Seaboard. I mean, I normally don't just kind of throw titles or tags out there, but just from experience, we worked together for a number of camps. And to be able to take that experience and parlay it and share that with kids at a variety of different levels, to me, that's been most impressive. Is there anything that just kind of motivates you to be able to share that knowledge? Because some people can't really parlay it to guys with different skill sets, but you've been able to do that. I think uh, I've always believed that someone gave to me, so I'm going to give back. You know, and I think that's what makes it easy. And then just to see the, the, um, uh, the look in the kids' eyes, to, you know, to find out things that they don't know about, like the simplest things, like getting in a stance that makes it easier. So right. I think for me to help them understand that the game of football is actually very, very simple and not complicated, I think that that's what makes it easy to, to convert it over. I learned something today from you when you talked about the – I've always heard about the six-inch step. But you mentioned something about the three-inch step, and it made so much sense to keep that stability, not not overstriding or whatever the case. Will you just touch on that a little bit? We'll give them a little nugget, even though they didn't come to camp. Let's give them a little taste. Exactly. I, I think where a lot of coaches, you know, uh, misinterpret uh, the six-inch step is that when you get in a right-handed stance and you have to go to your left, your left foot is going to be up. So if you take a six-inch step in your left foot, you're going to overextend yourself. So you have to cut it back half of it and basically at a three inch step to where you're actually still stable so you don't overstride. So it helps you with your front foot. So even if you're in a, in a left-handed stance, you take a six inch step with your right foot, it, it creates um, stability and not separation from both feet. Awesome, awesome. You heard it here first. A guy who could take a complex matter and, and, and simplify it. Uh, that's the name of the game. Um, in, anything different for 2018 that you've seen or you've noticed or you want to bring to the table as we, we, we take, it, take, our, take it on tour? I, I think um, the biggest thing is seeing the excitement of kids and understanding because, you know, a lot of kids don't want to play O-line or D-line. They want to be a linebacker or they want to be a wide receiver, and there's nothing wrong with that. Right. But uh, the, the game of football is played up front. And I think, you know, for 2018, I think what's really going to help, you know, with Camp Lyman is the excitement and the experience of the knowledge that they're getting from the, you know, from the coaches and the instructors. Because they're, these are not guys that are just, you know, coming out of that, you know, out of the gym lifting weights every day. These are guys that have the experience. So these kids are actually listening to guys who actually been in the trenches and understand what really goes on besides just what we read in the book. Well, once again, you heard it here, Coach Jay Haygood, Virginia Tech alumni, all you Hokies out there, make sure you follow J-A-Y-H-A-G-O-O-D. It's all good with Haygood. Hey